for all things Halloween. This is Hauntformer. And that's right, everyone. Jared and I are back to discuss our Scream Killer Theories for Season 2 of MTV Scream. First of all, I have to say, from our last review, Scream has gotten pretty much a lot better than it once was. At the beginning of the season, it was a little bit slow, but it's really caught up in momentum. And so, we thought we would count down a list of some of the people we think could be the killer for this season. So, I'm going to give my pick, uh, well, one of my picks. Jared and I have similar ideas, and then we'll give some honorable mentions. So, I'm going to say that the killer might be Kevin Duvall. Now, not the actor Kevin Duvall, but uh, Emma's dad, Kevin. Uh, Kevin was involved with the Brandon James murders as of 1994, I want to say. And uh, because of those murders, he is involved with the Brandon James case. You know, I'm sure he was jealous when Brandon and his now wife or ex-wife Daisy was hooking up with Brandon. And I'm sure that they probably got in some sort of... Uh, argument not just a mental one but probably a physical one too and it probably led to some harsh feelings between the two and i think that he could definitely be the killer why would he show up at the beginning of the season and not be back for no reason plus i was watching a video that talked about him and his hotel room was the same one that eddie krueger was murdered in so definitely makes for a little bit of a predicament with him now on to the honorable mentions I think my first honorable mention is going to be Mrs. Lang. I know she has some connection to Piper more than she says she does. She actually wears the same necklace that Piper had, and she went to the same orphanage. So she's going to be one of my honorable mentions. I'll give the other one to, uh, let's go with, um, let's say Eli. I don't think it's Eli because they pushed him way too much. I think they would reveal a killer that early. But maybe he has something to do with it because he did sneak into the mayor's office, so he definitely has something shady going on. Now, let's move on to Jared's opinions and see what he thinks the killer might be. Hey guys, Jared here. And, uh, yeah, so Mac and I have been watching the Scream MTV series, uh, ever since season one started. And I know my opinions, uh, on the show's second season have been... Uh, pretty critical if you've watched our review of the first five episodes of uh, season two. Uh, my opinions weren't very that positive about the show. And I can say that after those episodes, the show did start to pick up. And I became more invested in the characters again, and I think Mac did as well. And that's why, for this video, we wanted to do a video of our theories and who we thought the killers, uh, killer or killers could be. And my number one pick... And I think the uh, main pick on the uh, internet right now for the uh, main killer is Hiran, Emma's boyfriend, or on-off-again boyfriend. And that's kind of been with her the whole time, but hasn't really um, been 100% there. He's been on, running around, doing things, and that's why I think he's the killer. And what proves up my point or my theory that he's the main killer, is if you watch the latest episode, um, I'm not sure what it's called, but the episode that recently aired, uh, today's the 13th, and whatever the, the most recent episode is, you can see that the beginning of the episode starts with Kieran, and he goes to uh, Emma's bedroom, um, well, the killer goes to her bedroom, and... Then you see afterwards, Kieran coming home, and his hair's messed up. And if you guys know Kieran, his hair's always, uh, always well done, kind of like mine. And, uh, so he always has his hair done, especially when he's around Emma. But when he comes home to, uh, see Eli, his hair is not done. And there's another part in the episode where you see the killer, and then you see Kieran again, and his hair's not mess- and his hair's messed up. And it's not done, and anything like that. And that's why I think- that's another key point as to why I think he's the main killer. As for accomplices or runner-ups and honorable mentions, I don't really know who else it could be. Mac kind of labeled the big points. I personally don't think Eli's the killer. I think they have been pushing him too much. And I think, if anything, he could be somebody that's trying to stop Kieran, especially since Kieran's his cousin. So those are my theories. 
for Scream Season 2, and hopefully uh, next week we'll see who the actual killer is. Thank you again for watching, everyone, and I want to give a big shout-out to Mike Vaughn, the actual voice of the killer from Scream, for doing that little intro uh, for us here at Hauntformer, and a big shout-out to my friend Daniel, aka Distorted Figures, for getting that set up for me. Uh, thank you again so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and to check out the latest episodes of Scream on MTV. And remember, for all things Halloween, this is Hauntformer. Hauntformer.